Hello guys and welcome. Today I just want to talk about the seasons for expectation a little bit. So my first guess um, at the new download content, you know, the character, I my assumption now when I think about it now, it could possibly be a replacement female ninja character for Konimitsu, but it could also be Kunimitsu. So What's your guys' thought on it? Like, would you guys prefer to have Kunimitsu, or would you just have, or would you guys be happy with a substitute character for Kunimitsu, considering we have the same kind of situation with, like, Fukurom, right? He kind of is like a sub in for Bruce, but not really, because he's just a Mutai type character. But, you know, you could also have just a ninja style character, but with a different actual character, you know? with the same similar style so what's your guys thoughts on that and then um, I also want to ask what do you guys think Anna will get for a new move like considering the inputs you know she's got quite a bit of inputs that she doesn't utilize right 1 plus 2 is not utilized 3 plus 4 obviously not utilized a lot of a lot of uh, buttons neutral buttons are not utilized it's all like direction buttons and stuff like that but I hope for the most part I really hope she gets a new grab at least a one break grab you know I really need a one make break grab so at least when you're playing against players that you know are just smashing a break button you can at least get a mix up with the throw if you don't if we don't get a uh, one break throw grab then I guess uh, it would be nice to have a good wall bounce a new wall bounce because 4-4 four, four sucks right like the range on 4-4 four, four is just ridiculously bad and the uh, startup is so slow like I don't think there's any character in the game that has like a minus a, a 19 startup range range barely range 2 2.3 maybe yeah it's really bad like a 2.3 2.4 range yeah, so 2.4 range, 19 startup, and no tracking at all, right? It's just ridiculous, and then it's minus 14, so I hope they change the uh, wall bounce move. I really do. Like, this 4-4 four four <laughs> was not good to begin with. Like, make her <laughs> form this move is better, right? Because it's at least safe. You can spam it. At least safe, right? Uh... And it has tracking too. It has total tracking to the counterclock, uh, to the yeah counterclock side. Counterclock side it tracks fully. In then uh, clock side it doesn't track at all. But at least it has one side tracking. I'd rather take that, right? Because a lot of people like to walk counterclock anyways against Santa. I don't know why, but they do. Okay, and then if nothing is available, I mean I don't think a hop kick is that big of a deal. I don't really play hop kick style anyway but I mean it's great it's great to have a hop kick but I don't think I would take a hop kick if I can get a 12 frame move right a 12 frame starter move like let's say what's a good input for 12 frame you know a lot of people's 12 frames are usually like for I'm back one right a lot of them are back one this back one sucks right this back one sucks this back two sucks 4-2 sucks. Well, 4-2 is okay, actually. 4-1. Um, I don't know if I would want a 4-1 option. Because the reason why is that a 4-1... It's okay, but, like, you have so much, right? Like, up 4-1 and down 4-1 is too close. And then you have... If you have a 4-1, now you got all these... I'd rather just have 4-1 be a dash up 4-1, right? Like that. So, back 1 plus 2, or just a 1 plus 2. How about just a 1 plus 2 in from the neutral by itself, like this, right? Or maybe a 4, no, 4, 1 plus 2. There's already a 4, 1 plus 2. It's practically a 4, or maybe back 1, one back 1 plus 2 is a rage drive, so, a uh, rage art, so it's not good. Hmm. Yeah, if anything, maybe just 1 plus 2, like Lily's 1 plus 2, but shucks. 
That means oh. I, but I don't like the fact that if it's a one plus two, it's gonna be like a certain move where it just hits them one time, right? I want like a pause back one two, you know? <laughs> Maybe that's asking too much, you know? But I guess I mean even a one plus two, as long as it has like, it's as long as it has like about a two point three range. I want like at least two point three range because a lot of times when people do wake up kicks when they're down on the ground, they do wake up kick. It's at least this far, right? So you want enough like 1.3, 1.2, 1 1.2 maybe is reasonable, 1.2 so that you can at least punish those wake up kicks and I just want it for the wake up kicks primarily, other than that maybe for a uh, finisher off of this as well but you already have 4, 2, 3 so I guess it's not that bad, not big of a deal but the point is that if it's just a finishing option like if it's a wall splat 12 frame move I would prefer to have um, it just be like I said, 2.2 ish range with a, uh, you know, 1 plus 2 bang. And that's it. Yeah, so that's my hopes for Anna. Um, I don't really care about any other characters. So, yeah, uh, what's your guys' thoughts? And I mean, I know we don't really have much. Um, I don't think we can say anything. My point is to the direct to the developers at this point to like give them ideas at this point I think the best way is pretty much just hope for the best right and those are my hopes so yeah um, just a very small stuff I don't really expect much oh and then let's talk a little bit about um, that Paris stuff you know I don't I mean they didn't really explain anything about it but I'm curious if that Paris is like based on how often you play or I don't know anyways what's your guys thought on the power risk as well give me some insights on that I don't really know what that would be but as far as I'm concerned you know I don't really worry about those ranking and power risk stuff but the last thing is you know I hope this new character is very um welcome by you guys so yeah because i remember doing like a poll like i said and you guys vote mostly for kunimitsu but the question is would you guys be satisfied if there was a new ninja character just replacing kunimitsu style or would you literally prefer the character and yeah hopefully you guys put some comments there to answer that and see you guys next time and hopefully the updates well, I mean, hopefully we get more information soon, but I'm pretty sure the information is going to come like right before it's released like normal. But the problem is there is no actual date for it. So fall of 2020 sounds really far away yet really close. So who knows? My guess is it could possibly be next month. And yeah, that's it. See you guys next time. Hopefully you guys subscribe. Bye bye.